Back to small pillars of eternity. What do you do here, fine sir? I'm a forge master. I'm a master smith for the Crucible Knights. But the way I see it, I'm also keeping up with our old traditions. The first members of our order were smiths. Nowadays, most everyone's a professional soldier. I suppose it's to be expected. But I think it's important we keep up with our roots, too. What can you tell me about the knights? We were all smiths back in Hodrit's day. Though I'm about the only one here who still gets his hands dirty. We're a fearsome fighting force. Though these days, I think Cleaver takes more pride in our parade formations. He thinks himself a progressive man. But he's obsessed with soul lineage. And connections to Drywood's heroes of old. Other than Dunreed Row, really knows about any of that, though. Uh, goodbye. What else is in here? Hail, Traveler! Hamhelm, hello! I remember you. The young novitiate's armor is re recently shined, and his hair is clean and neatly combed. It's hard to believe he has ever seen battle, or that his scarred antique breastplate he wears could possibly he be his. Are you looking for something? Um, tell me about the Knights of the Crucible. We're the primary defenders of the Fines Bay. The Order's founders were the first to rally the Dewey independence. Of course, that's ancient history now. Now, mostly a prestigious company of soldiers in Drywood. We're the most prestigious. It's a glorious line of work. If you can forget about the barracks, and that's it. How does one someone become a knight? We don't just take anyone. Our members share soul lineage with the very men and women who defended this land a century and a half ago. He shifts his weight and coughs. Uh, anyway, Commander Clive is responsible for the initiates, but he rarely accepts foreigners. Does the name uh, Orsic sound familiar? He sniffs. If you got any self-respect, you won't associate with him. Or any of his new friends at the Expedition Hall, for that matter. Scamps and delinquents, the lot of them. What's the story between you two? Orsic has always held some controversial opinions. They went overlooked for the longest time because his family had such an extensive history of service to the Crucible Knights. He finally went too far and had to gal suggests that he had strayed too far that we had strayed too far from our roots, that some of our affi officials officers were beginning to resemble a dear nobility. He would have us all wear Rugspun and fight the forge hammers. I merely reported his statements. Um. That history made Crucible Knights what they are now. You can't just cast it aside. You've overgrown the past. Sometimes you need to move on. Is that his breastplate you're wearing? It was looks down and admits it. It became property of the Crucible Knights when he was discharged. But now, it's mine. And it's not for sale, if that's what you're wondering. Not every day you find armor that was used in rebellion. He says your affinity was forgery. Just what would he know about that? It's perfectly convenient for him to cast aspiration that's what with his heading up in the nights he falls his arm it's a lie of course 
Of course. Hmm. So, might have to find this uh, Aphrodite. But I'm not sure where they are hiding it. Just gonna no casually pick this lock. Um, nobody's seeing us, I right? Be discreet. Thank you. You guys don't need this. Oh, and it looks to. No, it's. Uh, tax collection. All earnings were lost to bandits. Well, that sucks. Um, that means we have to upgrade our security next. Or track these bandits. Not sure how I feel about that could this. also be a possibility. What's here? I suppose it can't be helped. Hope oh. that helps. Can't. See, and nobody's seeing us, friends. Thank you. Thank you. I suppose it can't be helped. There you go. And thank you. And, uh, we're just gonna quickly switch out this. That's, that's nice, isn't it? Uh, let's see, is there anything here? No, doesn't seem to be. Uh, and we have a room down here. Hello? What's this? So, here it is. I wasn't. I suppose Just it can't be helped. This log. There you go. And what does the flame reveal? It's nothing interesting here. What about here? Edict of arrest. This edict is called for the arrest of Eon. Eon. Whose recent activities have led to the death of the Crucible, of the Crucible Knight. Its requests reporting any information to Kreska Alma. Signed Commander Clive. Hmm. Uh, seems to be it here. Hello. Nothing else of interest in here, it seems. Some stairs up. I'm guessing this is where the commander is. Uh, just don't have the manpower. Uh, refugees from every corner of the Deerwood. The dozens getting them all riled up about animancy. At this rate, we'll need twice the soldiers to patrol Defiance Bay. Yes? Can I help you with something? Commander Clive stands in front of a massive table, studying a map. His expression is set in a grin form. He opens his mouth to say something to one of his men, but it follows the soldier's gaze over his shoulder to you. You're in charge of the Crucible Knights? Here in Defiance Bay, anyway. The High Justice is the leader of our order, but is currently stationed in Fleet Parker Castle. My job is to observe our forces in Defiance Bay and to keep order from the Duke. Was there something else I can do for you? Tell me about the Knights of the Crucible. He crossed his hand behind his back. We're the only professional army in Defiance Bay, or in, dr in the Dry Woods for that matter. We're defenders of the city. In Hard's day, we defended the city. We have improved our training since then, but Dunraid Roe can 
certify that many of our officers come from good Drywoodian fighting stock. Now, responsible for patrolling the city and keeping the peace, with so many refugees pouring in from the countryside, that's become more important than ever. Unfortunately, that's earned us enemies, particularly among the do dozens and some of the more enterprising families in Defiance Bay. What do the dozens have against you? Here's notes. They're damaging the mogers and troublemakers. They forgot that Defiance Bay is one of the largest cities in the world and not some frontier outpost. Most of them are mercenaries on a good day and street thugs the rest of the time. Needless to say, they've no patience for law and order. What can you tell me about the enterprising families? The house Demelian, namely. They're one of the soldiers' oldest noble families, and it's a criminal organization. Their patriarch, Gedmar, has been trying to take advantage of the turmoil to expand his operations. We got on top of him, and he hasn't been too happy about that. I see. Why don't you have enough soldiers? Uh, Fleet Breaker Castle. The High Justice has summoned almost half of my novitiates and more of my justiciars to a keep on the other side of New Hailmar. It's not for me to question the High Justice's orders, but it's left us shorthanded. And mark me, we're just a couple sparks away from anarchy. With so many newcomers, can't you just recruit more soldiers? More recruits means more training, which means more time from experienced soldiers that I don't have. Anyhow, I hardly see how this is any of your concern. If you've got the time to ask me about it, then perhaps you've got time to do something constructive. Forge Master Dunstein is working with the Anamancy Scholar to build what we're calling Forge Knights. Warriors that can patrol our streets without suffering from fatigue, disobedience, or fear. Some agitator throws a rock at them. We don't want to worry about things getting out of hand. He's constructed the armor, but we need the scholar's research. Unfortunately, she hasn't been around the last few times my novitiates have cracked. I've checked. Viana, Viana lives with the rest of the scriveners in the copper lane. They haven't the soldiers to, sp to spare at the moment. Go to Scriver's dormitory and see if you can find her. When you get the research, just bring it to those thing. This is the area. This is his area of expertise, anyway. Once you brought him the research, we can sell you any arms or armor if you have need. He forges and repairs all of our equipment. You won't find a more capable smith in the Fines Bay. Interesting. Uh, do you mind me casually sure picking how I this feel lock? This. Hope that helps. Then I guess you won't mind this as well. I suppose it can't be helped. That helps. Thank you. And we can just casually pick up something here. Uh, this is the same as what we have. Um, no, let's see. A blade in the dark. You do see me. He won't see me coming. And now you don't see me. Now I'm hidden. Now everybody's hidden? Question mark. Ooh. A fine war bow. Thank you. Now I can't I can't sneak around here, can I? Are you low? Yes, I can. Oh, interesting. Hmm. 
then I guess you don't mind me just casual looking. Plate armor. Thank you. I think that was that was a, f a fair payment for for me helping you. Don't you think? I think so. Um, is there anything? Hello. I don't see why we can't just borrow this Ooh, and a temple. This is a place where we can offer things to the gods, but I don't have anything to offer to him. There's no one to talk to. I think. No, we haven't been in here. This is a training ground. The Justiciera is gaze flickers over you briefly before returning to the novitiates gathering in the training area. If this is about the patrol, my novitiates are already scratched to the limit stretched to the limits between refugee influx and a mess at Heritage Hall. I simply don't have enough units to spare. After a pause she looks over at you again. I'm sorry, was there anything else you needed? Something wrong at Heritage Hill. She lowers her voice. What isn't wrong is a real question. The whole district of walking flesh eating corpse who sealed the area two months ago, just after I lost one of my finest commanders there. And yet this is the second guard rotation to disappear. There were already enough rumors about the place floating around the keep without my soldiers whispering about these disappearances. She s shakes her head. I just as soon abandon the district, but if those monsters should find a way out... What could you tell me about Heritage Hall? It used to be one of the most prestigious districts in the Fiance Bay, but a few months ago the residents all went mad started eating one each other and anything else that had the bad luck to wander into the streets. I've never seen anything like it. Now every novitiate that stands guard there, every one that comes back. Anyway, talk of the stench of the grave and the groans of the unspeakable horrors. She holds up a plate clad with finger. The, the why and the how are questions for animances. I've sealed the district in hope of containing whatever happened there. It seems to be working for now. Um, I could look into it if you want. Uh, she steps back and regards you. And what I just told you, you want to go to Heritage Hall? I've lost trained soldiers there. Why should I let anyone in? Uh, Your trained knights have nothing on me. You're so eager to rush to your death. I won't stop you. She quickly looks on one of the novitiates. And if you're somehow able to put a stop to this, got my permission to enter Heritage Hall. I'll send word to the guards at the gates. So what do you do here? I'm in charge of the keeps novitiates. I'm responsible for the training and patrol ar arrangements. She nods at the group gathered in the training room. They're good soldiers, and they've been quick to adapt to new challenges. Very well. So now we have a place we can check out. Uh, this seems to be the end of this place, yes? Yes. So, now we have to, uh, let's see, this is Heritage Hall, this is Retreat Stone Scroll, uh, bring Penham. Uh, 
alternative to Kern. Uh, Kern's the cipher sign of Anonymous. Aphrodite works at Hayden's house in Brackenbury. Then I guess Brackenbury might be next. And after that, we might look into her to troll. Um, just gonna see quick. Uh, uh, here the troll is up here. And uh, Adana's gift is down here. And we have to go back to Copper Lane to go, go into the catacombs. We don't need to go back there yet. But I'm gonna end it here folks. So thank you all for watching and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching folks.